Xbox and Snap. I don't know why I'm having such bad luck with Minecraft roleplay and stuff today. And to date this, this is when my friends were over and we tried recording stuff. It's not working on my phone, or what's going on? It's the broadcast I just did, and... Aside from that, it's not showing anything happening live. Quickly restart my phone. Oh no, I can no longer fly. What will I do? Uh, so... I guess I should hang out down here for now. So Hugh's back, there will be explanation for that. I start up the roleplay, it won't be satisfying, but... Murder was kind of unexpected. There we are. Oh, you, no. Ugh. Wait, you? You're here? Oh, hey, Corbett, I see you're finally up. Well, yeah, but... I thought you were dead. Oh, uh, I have no idea what you're talking about, Corbett. You were turned into a zombie or something. Oh, uh, no, I just sort of... Waited a while for you to get back here, and then you never did, and so I ended up having to go out there and search for you, and then you were passed out on the ground, and so I had to bring you back here. Something like spider Bam or something. Well, thank you very much, Hugh. What's weird, it was like, everything suddenly stopped working in here, like, the door and the torches and stuff. Well, I also did some other stuff for you, like, I heard you talking in your sleep or something, and I decided to get some glowstone for you, and I put it in your chest. Well, thank you, Hugh, uh. I guess I, we, this place could use the next. Go and set that up. Man. 
felt so real. That was terrifying. I should set these up in some of the darker points. Yeah, I could use some on the roof as well. Yeah, I won't climb up there just yet, but... i sure to include some lighting up there. And that was some horrific dream last night, Hugh. Oh, oh what happened, Corbett? So I remember still being out there, and and I all coming home and. I came inside and you weren't anywhere to be found, and then I went outside and then I just saw you and you were like a zombie or something. And do anything about it. I tried putting you in a sort of stone area so that I could figure out a way to heal you like Brittany's done for me in the past. Well, not for me, but I know that I had a lot of stuff with potions and I figured that I could at least try and figure something out. To try and learn some stuff from her, and I think I heard something about there being a way to restore zombies to life, which that does sort of feel like the definition of zombie, a reanimated corpse, but... I, I guess he'd be a more alive version of a corpse. Well, in either case, it's all over now, unless it was some sort of weird premonition, but... I was basically hallucinating, so... Bob level stupid to... That... Out it. Well, not convenient, but I'll have to do until I can figure out some way to wire everything. Of 
electrical wiring, but... These zombies won't be as likely to appear in the house. So there are still a few dark areas down on the first floor. Oh, hey, you brought the sand back, too. I guess I'll get started on building the greenhouse for you. Or at least prepare the materials for that. All this is certainly lighting up the area. Well, I guess that didn't work. Maybe if I were to put something under the fridge. What are you talking about, Corb? What are you talking about, Corbett? Well, I just tried to... ...light up the inner part of the fridge, and... ...the door didn't exactly fit in there, so... ...I had to figure out something better. Oh, well, yeah, uh, Glowstone does have a bunch of fridges, and that doesn't exactly help in the placing of Glowstone and all the doors and stuff. Yeah. Now I know that. Oh, hey, is the glass done? Oh, almost. Well, not really, but... That was all the coal available in the lower area. Guess I'll start. I'll head out for now and quickly place the glass I just got. I should make this pretty big. Uh, make it so that Hugh at least feels like he can sort of go outside. Sixteen should be a good amount.
improvement. Out the area a bit more, and then I guess I'll head back inside. Lighting certainly helped out in here, Hugh. Oh. It certainly not going to get dark in here during the night. But I guess that's fine. Yeah, well. I agree. As long as it helps protect us. Good night, Hugh. Good night, Corbett. Good night. I put more of that glasses. The sand. Ah. Early morning grogginess doesn't help with the speaking. M20 glass. That should give me some more to work with. I guess I should take some more measurements outside. Okay, so... I estimate that that's about three meters of the house, and so... The fourth meter I should... Place the glass. Yeah, this will look really nice. And then maybe I could start making the farm or whatever in here. At least grow something. Utilize the area for a for more enjoyable reason. I'll have to include some lighting, but... Maybe... Oh! Shoot, I think my shovel broke, but... And I don't have that much more to dig.
How much farther can I go? Right here. I go this way then. Alright. This is right in line with keep my balance. All right. Oh. Well, that's a little out of place. I'll save a door until later, because... Seems too big of a risk to allow anything to enter at this point. I can fill in some of this area. The falling hazard. As open as it is. But at the same time, I need to make sure that I can still get down here. Maybe I should also add it to that hole over there. I mean, maybe a few repairs, but... Not crazy over the top. That area there so that I can still go back up.
Maybe some of the areas next to the house, too. As long as I can fix how things... As long as I can anything... That'll be good for you. I mean, I doubt that that hole right there had any major importance. It's not like it was designed as an escape tunnel or something like that, but... Oh, looks nice. All... Allow it. I'm fine with leaving some holes in the area, just so long as they... don't just completely act as some sort of Danger to he or myself. Blow on some food until I get the farm up and running. Uh, a little bit too much cobblestone, and I don't have any real reason in mind for needing feathers. <sighs> oh no, my rose bush. A cow? You? Where did this cow come from? Oh, you were away. It was just sort of waiting by the door, and so I decided to let him in, cause... He looked kinda lonely and like he needed a home. What? <laughs> cow! Yeah? He's a cow, so what? people, you have a dog upstairs. Well, couldn't you at least put him down in a hole or something? What sort of insane person are you? Are you an animal sadist? No? I just don't like the idea of walking along cow pies in the... 
Oh, don't worry, I'll let him outside when he needs to go and stuff. I'm pretty sure he's house trained. All right, you all. I'll... I'll trust you on this, I guess, but... If you ever run low on food, I'm eating him. Hey, is that a deal? Oh, uh, sure, I don't care. I mean, I just want him to stay here. Maybe that could be the reason that we need him here. Well, whatever. Need a name. Don't exactly seem the type that would. Hey, where are you going? Don't seem the type that would just go by the name Cow and. Maybe Edgar? No, no. Edgar sounds like some sort of science experiment. Uh. You can be called Laverne. You with you, Laverne? Okay. I'm gonna do some more work on the greenhouse area. Maybe you could live out there. You? Since we're keeping the cow, I'm naming him. Her. I haven't really decided to check out its gender, but... I'm going to call it Laverne. Okay. Whatever. Do what you like, Corver. I don't care, just as long as the cow stays here and we can use it for meat or something. You really are a wonderful person, Hugh. Role model for the world. Oh, well, I try to be. Oh, hey, more food. The friend says hi. Should have trusted them when... It, him, her, cow, told you to follow it, join it on its adventure inside. To sum up what I said in cow, <laughs> I think you got the message now. Or not. I just turned him into beef. That's the circle of life. I'm sure you Doesn't well. He's a cow. He can figure it out. Uh, 
That may be a little high. I mean, I'm uh, alright with some of the area being like that, but... Not areas where it's unnecessary. Oh, hey, is there anything down here? Nope. Oh, dear. So if I wanted to grow sugar cane in here, that would be about three high, so maybe I should go Better be very careful not to fall. That could be seriously... Seriously bad or... Fatal or something. Man, that must have been a reoccurring nightmare last night. Not even sure how many times I died. But, like I said before, it's alright now, he's okay, and, well, as okay as he can be. I've got to be more careful with these. Well, I guess this means I should get back to doing some I've got a good amount with that run, but Oh, perfect! I'll check by the river. Thank you. 
and it's getting late. I guess I'll smell what I have for the moment and then... Collect some more tomorrow. Whoa. All right, we're in. Oh, sorry, Hugh, I didn't mean to bump into you. Uh... I'll, I'll see you in the morning. Did I call you again? Uh... Laverne. Oh. We're getting a full house here. Uh... Don't cows usually like to... I guess once I grow some in the greenhouse, then I'll get you out there with it. Okay, gonna want to avoid that guy. Oh, poor squid. Pretty far away from the ocean. Wish I could do something for him, but... I think I had like 40 collected for the last time, and that was a decent amount. Um. Oh, I think 55 was more like it. I have 20 in there at the moment, and... He tends to... Make about... Um... Twelve, eighteen... Three sets of glass.
And I have 35 now. Uh... Unless I find any more decent amounts, I... Or anything sticking up. This should be all I need. Oh, uh, I guess I am out of dirt. I see some fresh meat for you. And slightly more importantly myself, given that I'm doing stuff. So I guess the food supply is really not that limited. I wonder how all the animals in the world survived. Um, maybe five more. That should be a decent amount for my purposes. That doesn't hurt to be cautious. We all save a certain amount, and I'll use that to grow any water-based items. Start with two, and then I'll wait for it here, and by the time it's done dealing with these, the rest should be ready to go, or at least ready by tomorrow, which That's fine in itself. Hi, Hugh. Hello, Kruger. I guess I could have watermelon for now, and...
my strength up and then wait for the meat. You kind of want to save this for later. Uh... Yeah, five should be good. I'll save some for Oh no. be just about good for the day. Get this row to the end and then Oh. Spider! No! At least I know that Laverne will keep you safe, you. Pretty loyal, sticking by your side like this. Oh, whoa. You know that that's the best place to stay, cuz. Some creature or whatever might confuse her for, uh. Actual cow that deserves to be eaten, but she's Laverne, so... He? He? Er? Whatever. First to have a chance to live. Oh. Hey, I think that your meat's done. Why, so it is. And the sand is getting there. Hi, Hugh. Oh. Uh, Hugh? Notice. Were you watching me sleep? No. I was just sort of standing there at the stairs, trying to go to bed myself, and then you caught me just as I was standing there. Uh, alright, uh... I guess that's okay, uh... Let's get back to work here.
burn. I'm talking to cows. What's next? Talk back to me? I could talk with animals. I ought to stop doing that, class. Um... What else could I use? Guess I'll top it out with glass or something. Like, full glass. Not these panes. But they could be helpful with windows, so... Maybe I'll save them for the future. Not hurt to be prepared for scenarios. Ouch. Ah. He said I didn't twist my ankle. And falling hurts. Aside from the physical pain, it sort of hurts the pride. On self, what happened to being extra careful? Oh, keep focused, don't think about the ground that is far below you, and if you make it well, not think about it, cuz. That is a self-fulfilling prophecy. Ouch.
Not like it even hurts that much, it just sort of stings. It. I'm wasting resources. Up now. further down the river. And I need as much as I can get. Oh, there's, there's a lot over here. Requires a lot of fording the river, but... At the very least, it... Get me closer, if not to the amount that I need for the roof of the town. Oh. This is some. Uh, need to get back to you. The longer I'm away during the evening, the more likely he is to happen to him again. If Danny or I was relighting. Curves. Ow! 
Oh, they're out. Gotta hurry home. I see two cows? Ow. What's going on here? Oh, hello, Corbin. I thought that would burn me to the friend. There was another cow waiting outside the door, so I decided to let it in here, and so it's gonna stay here, because it's my house, and... They're just sort of living here with me. How many animals happen to come by your house on an average basis? I don't know. Only three have managed to stay here for... make this a permanent home. Danny... Have been rubbing off on me. So, if anything, blame yourself for finding that dog. But at least he gives us some form of defense. Yeah, and these cows give us something to eat. Can't argue with you there. You. Well, good night. That, dear viewers, I believe I am done for the night. A progress on the greenhouse, and got two unexpected guests in the house. I can fly again. Uh, so. I'm gonna put that side. So, I'm sorry, I, I actually think that this was done for an hour and a half, but the sad news is, is I'm, I believe that I'm getting off sort of early. And, I mean, there are reasons for that, given that I had an early start in comparison to when I go to sleep. Like, between you and me, I usually happen to get to sleep at, like, nine, because I have other stuff I focus on at given times, but even then I tend to get to sleep at, like, with this, like, 5.30 or 6.30, because I have some stuff that I need to do, and I also tend to watch some stuff, but I'm happy to do it, and the evenings are the best point in time for me, so evenings, early morning, so I didn't really do Too much recording tonight. Uh, in I did have my friends over, which that was part of it. And uh, next time I'll try and do a better job of reeling them in and in with the RPG stuff, because some other people who might be more interested. RPG, this isn't a role-playing game, this is a role-play. I think that those are slightly different.
but um, yeah, just probably need to figure out some more stuff before I start to try and get others involved. But I also did some Let's Play stuff with Vivage, which that was pretty fun. A bunch of people showed up. Fortunately, I didn't see Surefire North, but that's cool. Uh, shout out to Werelex for the comment. I'm sorry that I did not point in, but this is a roleplay. Uh, I'm Clues. Slash at Clues Wild. Twitter for having like my Minecraft role play. Uh maybe I should figure out something like a Twitter or Facebook page and Or something else that I can get some other people to join, but first money and a job. So that I can buy the equipment to do that sort of thing. Uh What else? Uh, that's just about all I can think of to say for the time being. Xbox, Snap Twitch. Um... Gonna load up the lower right image of myself. Hello. Ah. Uh, so. I'll be returning to the normal recording schedule tomorrow, but my mom's not going to be here, so I might be able to start recording stuff earlier, like 6.30 or 7. Also, it allows me to sleep in a bit. But if one feels like checking in at that point, please do, and, uh... Wiggle my ears with my fingers. Less impressive than doing it anyway, but it feels like doing whatever I want. At the given time. Uh, so. I think I will now say. Uh, let's stop.